tutorial, we'll make a funny polar bear toy and needle felting books keychain. Let's make a felted bear with a fish first. We'll make a polar bear, so take white wool and shape a ball. Punch a body on a sponge using a felt needle of size 38. Add wool as far as needed to get an appropriate size and density. It also helps smooth the surface. When the body becomes oval shaped, sharpen the top. There will be a neck attached. Make the belly round. The body is still egg shaped. We are making a sitting bear, so punch the bottom. Form an angle. Make a neck. Roll up a wool robe. Punch until dense. Leave the edges loose to attach easier. Tack the neck to the body. Smooth the junction by tacking some wool. Needle felt thoroughly. Make an oval head. Punch one side. Don't pierce the attachment place. Tack to the neck, punching the curl. Make the neck thicker near the body and thinner under the head. Smooth by tacking some extra wool. Use two or more needles to speed up the felting job. Punch hind paw attachment areas on the body sides. Roll up wool to shape a foot. Add a small tuft for a thigh to the loose area. Punch well, forming a hind paw. Make the curl more distinct. Add some wool and continue punching until dense. The paw should be round and bent. Punch the foot. Tack the hind paw to the body. Hide the junction. Now make four paws. Shape it long. Tack near the neck. Add wool to cover the junction and form shoulders. Fold and punch small ears. They should be oval and dense. Deep in the center to create a natural look. Tack to the head. Keep in mind the junctions. Add a charming smile with beige wool. Make a black nose. Needle felt eyes in the same way. Make them a bit smaller than the nose. Make a blue fish. Punch a blue rove to get the appropriate size and density. Make one side longer to shape a tail. Form a round head on the other side. Needle felt a caudal fin. Tack it to the tail, punching all around. Make the fin fork shape to look natural. Sharpen the ends. Tate a scale pattern with a thin rove of black wool. Use white wool for the eyes. Add a bit of black wool to make the eyes more expressive. Punch a line to define a smile. Put the fish into the bear's paw. Tack it to keep it in place. Add some details to the hind paws. Punch a foot pad using the beige wool. And add a belly button as a finishing touch. We've made an eco-friendly smiling felted bear with a fish in his paw. This funny toy will cheer you up each time you look at it. And now, let's make a needle felting book's keychain. Take red wool to make a book. Punch the wool flat to make a book cover. Add the wool gradually to make the cover dense and thick. Cut out a square shape. 
Make pages either by needle felting white wool or using felt fabric. Fold the pages in half and sew them down. Join the cover with the pages decorating the book with a running stitch. Make another smaller blue book to make a keychain. Take a chain, a keychain ring, and embellishments. Attach a round metal embellishment to the red book. Pass the chain through a jump ring and add the keychain ring. Fasten another embellishment to the blue book. Join the books with the chain. We've got a cute needle felting books keychain to keep your keys elaborately safe. We have shown you a wonderful way of how a shapeless rove of unspun wool can turn into an amusing toy or original accessory. Share your impressions. Join us on the social links. Be sure to subscribe to our channel to see new DIY projects about how to make amusing toys and other crafts for kids and adults.